Hey, city family, what is up? It is Bobby coming at you from my happy place, the grocery store. But you might recognize this is Sprouts. We haven't been here in a long time, so I thought I was overdue. And spoiler alert, there are some really epic stuff that I've never seen before at Sprouts. That's the cool thing. You see stuff here you've never seen before. Let's do what we always do, walk around, show you what's good, what's bad, how to read those ingredients, and put the best quality stuff in your and your family's body. Less talking, more shopping, let's walk around Sprouts. As you can see by the fog on the glass, Leilani and I are inspecting every ice cream here. And I'm going on the record, Leilani. I think Sprouts has the best Bobby approved ice cream selection on the planet. I and mean, right? Yeah. And I'll show you why. Check this out. So, number one, it's like the only place you can find one of the best ice creams I always have in my freezer, Cosmic Bliss. Used to be Coconut Bliss, but now they also have organic 100% grass-fed ice cream in addition to the uh, dairy-free one. So if you look at the ingredients here, it's made with organic grass-fed cream and milk. It's sweetened with coconut sugar. The peanut butter does not have any sugar or refined oils and it has real vanilla extract. And to be honest, a two-third cup serving only has 14 grams of added sugar and it's a paleo sweetener. It's really good for ice cream. This stuff is so rich and creamy. Now I've had this one here, and that's an amazing deal, $5.99 right now, but we're no dairy at home, so which is why I get this one here, the dairy-free. And this dairy-free, this one, chocolate peanut butter is legit. Now, people have been scanning this with the Bobby Approved app, wild good. And honestly, the ingredients are wild good. Wanna see something impressive? Boom goes the dynamite, look at this. So dairy-free, made with extra virgin olive oil. No cruddy ingredients, no natural flavors, two-third cup serving, little high in the sugar there, 24 grams, but still, that's really clean for ice cream. This is a very impressive one that I just saw for the first time. Oh, someone just lights out, someone just dropped something. Eat mud, somebody scanned this with the Bobby approved app. All right, there we go, we're back on. Look at these ingredients here. Unbelievable. The brownie, can you see that? The brownie is made with dates and banana flour. What the what? Another sale here. That's fantastic. This ice cream selection here, whoa, give me a high five. <laughs> be you, be you. Wait until you see what's behind me. Because listen, we all know, you know, Hugh Gems, Hugh Hunks are delicious. But my friends, we were walking by over here and I saw a cart and I saw some huge chocolate here. I haven't seen this anywhere else. Look at this. This is 100% organic grass-fed milk chocolate. I actually had a sample of this back in March at the Expo West in Anaheim, and I knew it was coming soon, but I haven't seen this at any other grocery store. This is the only Bobby-approved milk chocolate in the world because number one, Leilani, it's sweetened with coconut sugar like they always do, right? but organic grass-fed milk with the chocolate, with the coconut sugar. What the what? This is cray cray. I don't know. Yeah, we're taking it for <laughs> sure because I don't even know where you can buy that. That's super cool. Well, we just talked about the ice cream. And if you watch my stories, I was here last weekend specifically to get these. And I have talked about them in the past. These cones here, eight cones for $4.49. My friends, these are maybe the only Bobby approved ice cream cones on the market. They're coconut milk based. So look at these ingredients here. They're crazy. We have coconut milk, a little bit of rice flour, and coconut sugar. There's only five grams of added sugar per cone, and it's coconut based. You know those coconut rolls we show at Costco all the time and the ones from uh, Aldi the other week? This is like a cone version of that. Nobody else makes this, I don't understand why. This cone with one of those ice creams over there, you are winning summer, my friends. I wanna show you something that we actually bought last weekend, and it is this right here. The Sprouts Kids Ear Clear Oil, because we had to take Rose to the uh, doctor because she had a virus, and luckily it wasn't too serious, it wasn't COVID, and uh, he said her ear had a mild ear infection. We didn't wanna give her an antibiotic necessarily, but we picked this up, and it worked great, and she was better the next day. We avoided the antibiotic. What's great about this, it's hard to find clean, ear oil or ear like um, medicine online. This is super interesting. It's homeopathic based, garlic bulb, arnica flour, extra virgin olive oil based. 
It's $12.99. I'm super happy we found this, and I was super happy for Rose's uh, recovery. Uh, the reason why I'm also in the supplements aisle is, you guys know I don't take many supplements. I take vitamin C, my probiotic, and as cold and flu season gets here, I'm coming out with a new D3, K2, zinc combo. But for daily uh, probiotics, you cannot beat this, Seed. Seed is obviously a longtime supporter of the channel, but in my opinion, this probiotic, that's also a symbiotic because it's a prebiotic po a probiotic, is the best one on the market. I talk about it all the time. Most all on the marketplace are a waste of money. They don't work, they die in your stomach acids. Seed works because it doesn't dissolve or die in your stomach acid. The only thing that comes off in your stomach is the outer capsule, which is actually made of pomegranates, which is high in fiber. It feeds your gut bacteria, fiber-rich foods do. It's a prebiotic. And then the inner capsule swims, swims, swims like Nemo, all the way down to your colon to deliver 24 strains of custom bacteria that work for bowel movements, constipation, immunity. And yes, they have the parents or the big boy one, but they also just came out with the pediatric one, PDS08, for kids three to 17 years old. And Rose just started taking that too. My friends, if you take a probiotic or you're in the market, try C for adults, for kids, for my money, in my opinion, best one on the market. My link down below always, always, always gets you 15% off your first month's uh, supply, free shipping, and they ship all around the world for a flat rate, and it's 30 days risk-free. We love seed. Check it out. You'll love it too. This is another reason why I like sprouts. You just see stuff you don't see anywhere else. Tortillas. Yeah, I've seen those. Of course, I've seen siete. I've never seen these in a grocery store. Unbun, who makes really good uh, keto bagels and bread, has an untortilla. I tried these last year in the mail. I ordered them. They are ridiculously good. And looking at ingredients, wow, wow, wee, wow. Look at this, almond flour based, pumpkin seed protein. What kind of oil? Best in class, extra virgin oil, no grain, no cruddy ingredients. Here's the cool thing. Two tortillas have three net carbs. So each tortilla has one and a half net carbs. This is phenomenal and honestly, Keto or not, I think the texture of these is one of the best tortillas I've ever had, and they're on sale now. $6.99 for six of them. So it is slightly expensive, but just a little more than Siete, and for my money, I'd rather have these. And then the one that just fell here is another one that's great, but I've only seen it on Amazon, never at a store. Marie and Ricardo. Que paso, Marie and Ricardo. Look at that. Once again, clean as can be. This one has eight net carbs for two, so more net carbs, and $6.99 for six. So I'd rather get the unbuns. Both are great, but my friends, this is cool to see. All right, Leilani found something really interesting, and another thing I've never seen in person, only on the Bobby Approved app. Spoonable smoothie, strawberry, and what's that one? Peanut butter. Peanut butter. I'm going to show the ingredients on peanut butter because I love me some peanut butter. So this is a really good idea because instead of being a drinkable, it's a, it's a frozen spoonable smoothie here. Bananas, dates, black seed. The only sugar in here comes from the banana and the dates. No cruddy ingredients. How are the ingredients on that one? This one's perfect too. Let's see here. I got a full organic. Oh, really? Yeah. Look at that. Oh, nice! It's on sale too, $2.99 for a little spoonable smoothie. Now, in case you haven't heard, you have to shop Sprouts on the sale. Yeah. This is an expensive grocery store, but fans taught me years ago, if you come on the sales, they have a lot of BOGOs and stuff like that, like the ice cream we just showed. Otherwise, woo, it's a little too pricey. <laughs> <laughs> Very exciting discovery here in the yogurt case. This, Coco June is now making overnight oats. And I did try a sample this back in March at the Expo West in Anaheim. My friends, these are great because a lot of people scan mush with the Bobby Approved app and they're not quite Bobby Approved. Why? Everything is really clean there. It's coconut milk based, there's no cane sugar, but the oats are not organic. And you really wanna get organic oats because of the prevalence of glyphosate. And that's not always a fail safe, but organic oats in my opinion are a must. Well. Say hello to Coco June Overnight Oats. This is super impressive. Not only is it organic uh, oats in there, it's coconut yogurt based, sweetened with a touch of coconut sugar here. No natural flavors, no cruddy ingredients. This one has, I can't see. Two grams. Two? 
smallest print ever. Two grams of added sugar in the form of coconut sugar. Holy cow, this is fantastic. Most of the yogurts are good. I think that flavor for some reason has cane sugar, but this is very, very impressive. I would grab those for sure. Oh, my friends, I know for a fact, this is a Sprouts exclusive. Say hello to the most Bobby approved pizza bites you've ever had. Now think of like Totino's and the stuff you had as a kid. If you read those ingredients, it's the opposite of being Bobby approved. This is crazy. So this is cheese. My favorite is the organic pork, which I have at home. Look at these ingredients. So let me come on the light here. It's gluten-free. It's made with olive oil. The cheese in here is organic, 100% grass-fed mozzarella cheese. They're using olive oil, organic vegetables, zero filler ingredients, zero crud. These are unbelievable. Me, Desi, and Rose go crazy for these. And they're on sale at $7.99. They're a bit expensive. I do buy them online with a promo code sometimes for probably cheaper, but that's a good deal. Now, speaking of good deals, we have a clearance, Clarence. $4.50 off, because these are being discontinued. I've seen a couple versions of these at Whole Foods. This is unbelievable. They're well carved. My friends, these are organic pork meatballs. So look at this, organic non-GMO pork with brown rice, organic vegetables, and that's it. Holy cow, this is epic ingredients. I wonder why it's being discontinued. I guess nobody wants it. They want the crappier meatballs. This is a great deal. I would run Forest Run. They have this and the Mediterranean ones. I assume those are Bobby approved too, but this is epic. These pizza bites are great. The frozen section here at uh, Sprouts could be the best frozen section in the world. I'm not even joking. These are yet another Sprouts exclusive. My friends, Gold Rush from Canada are the only frozen fries that don't have cruddy processed oils on there. I've tried fries from everyone. Alexia, the Whole Foods brand, organic or not, they always have canola on there. And remember, canola oil, whether it's expelled or pressed, organic is still a processed seed oil that's free radical aid and inflammatory. You gotta avoid those. Well, this is the only one who does it. And yes, you can make your own fries at home, but in case you wanna be lazy, these are organic fries here. You see the ingredients? Where are they? Boom, that's it. Just rusted potatoes. They also have sweet potato fries, which I don't see right now. Yes, it's more expensive than making your own. The only thing I have a hard time doing, I've tried to air fry these and bake them, and they don't get as crispy as the ones that have the cruddy oil on there. Does someone know, am I doing something wrong? Sometimes I put a little bit of oil on there. I air fry them in the basket and they still don't get super crispy. If you have any tips, leave a comment down below. I'd still rather have those than the ones with the cruddy oil and you can only find them here at Sprouts. All right, family, that is it from Sprouts. I don't know about you, but pretty impressive. Yeah. It's very fun to come here, especially when you haven't been here in a while. And behind us in the chill chest, the ice creams for the summer. Like I said, I'm going on record best ice cream selection in the biz. So hightail it down to Sprouts. Hopefully there's one by you. Hopefully there's a good sale because that's how you gotta shop it here. But for Leilani and myself, we leave you like we always do. Hashtag keep on cooking. Mad love and peace. Yeah. Whoa, lights out. <laughs>